Ah, hello everybody. So I am heading off to work today and my boss isn't gonna be there this morning which is okay because then i can get more stuff done like a lot quicker um but anyways so i'm gonna work there for maybe an hour or two it shouldn't take real long and then i'm gonna be going to the dmv to finally switch the title on my car today's a good day to do it and then i have to get my oil changed as well and if i could do some uber eats i totally will it's just going to depend on how quick the other two things go and kind of how the day goes at my house um my niece and nephew might be coming down i'm not totally sure but if they do then of course i want to go home and hang out with them for a while but that's just kind of my brief plan for the day i just don't have a well it's like i do have a lot going on but i also kind of don't oh one exciting thing i've just like kind of realized I could do with my car is I can adjust the volume and switch songs from my steering wheel which for some reason I like it didn't fully click that I could do that but now I'm trying to like train myself to get used to doing that so kind of fun oh I finally remembered to bring my sunglasses into the car because the guy that I got the car from left his sunglasses in here but I don't really like them so I'm probably gonna toss them but yeah so now I can put my sunglasses in the car they need to be washed they still sand on them from Daytona but what are you gonna do that's my plan for the day right now my car says negative 12 I guess Bismarck made the news like negative 20 the other day or something I don't know the only reason we ever make the news in North Dakota is because of how cold it is so that's kind of depressing but anyways I think I'm just gonna vlog today and then this will be like another funzy little vlog that I do because like in my last one that I said I don't know what I'm gonna vlog or what I'm gonna post it's just gonna be for fun and when I want to so, yeah. The DMV only took me literally 40 minutes, which I did not feel like was super bad. And the gal was so nice. We were making jokes. We were having fun together. It went perfectly fine. So next I'm gonna go and get my oil changed, but I'm kind of thinking of, uh, I was thinking of maybe getting something to eat or drink while I sit there and get my oil changed because that could take about an hour or two. Yeah, okay. I didn't really tell you anything, but. <laughs> Now, I really would have loved a cold stone, but like, how do you just walk into an oil change with a little thing of ice cream? Not to mention my car says it's negative five, so I would look like a psychopath, but I really, 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 really want cold stone. Maybe later. All right, oil is changed. It went well, the guy was super nice. And actually, this is the same place. Ooh, sorry. The same place where the guy that owned the car before me took it. So the information was already in there, which was fantastic. So we are good to go. And I think, like I said, I think I'm going to turn on Uber Eat and try to just make a little extra money today. So I spent quite a bit. Just the oil change was like $95, which I mean, it is a bigger car. So it makes, I don't know, it makes sense. It's not gonna be, you know, 40 to 50 dollars like my camry was so that's just how it goes but now uber eats and i will let you guys know if anything interesting happens oh are you using a mobile app uh not today okay i'm gonna get started for you. um i'll just have a medium fry please all right first one the place thank you i'm so tired of compacted snow uh yeah if you don't mind thank you thank, thank you, you. Okay, so I literally got two orders on Uber Eats, but it's almost two o'clock and I'm sure that one reason I wasn't getting more was because I wasn't out right away, like at the lunch rush. It seems like the sooner you're out, the higher priority you kind of get when it comes to like new orders coming through. So since I don't think I'm gonna be getting a lot of orders anyways, I thought I would get a fry and then go do some thrift shopping at Goodwill maybe just for fun and then just go home and edit videos I think that's my plan right now so we'll see when I tell you I want to steal that shopping cart so bad but I seriously don't know why Goodwill 
Apple was very good to me today. Okay, so I'm just gonna like briefly go through everything. This is a 32 degrees pullover that my mom wants. And I actually found another one that's the exact same, but in green that I wanna keep. Then I found this Scooby-Doo pullover. That is gonna be on Poshmark probably. And a lot of this stuff actually is. So if you guys are interested in it, um, I'll have the link down below. And then this Y2K Old Navy sweatshirt. Someone has this listed for like $60 on Depop. So I'm probably gonna list it for like maybe $25 or $30 because I was like, that's unreal. And then this was kind of cool. So if you're a Taylor Swift fan, it is a ever and ever more hoodie. It's a, it is a small, but I think it's supposed to be oversized. So again, if you're into this, I saw one sold on Depop for like $75. I will put it on for much less than that. Trust me, because I think that's outrageous. And then this Y2K Aeropostal sweatshirt. I was just kind of curious if like these are getting popular again with Y2K being so popular once again. So I'm gonna list that as well. That'll probably be pretty cheap. This Dutch Bros coffee pullover, which is really cute. If I worked at Dutch Bros, I totally would have kept this because I love this vibe. My cousin actually worked at Dutch Bros. I think she still does, I don't know. But one of these sold for like, <laughs> I wanna say, actually no, I don't wanna say because I looked at a lot of numbers, so I'm sure whatever I'd say would not be correct. Then I thought this was really cool. It's a Columbia kind of windbreaker jacket. I'm on the fence or not whether I'll keep this, so I'll try it on at home. It looked like maybe it's a little bit big. I don't think it's a small, like it was hung up as a small. And then last but not least, the 32 degrees um, pullover that I'm gonna keep in this kind of green color. So that's what I got from Goodwill. Now I'm gonna do a TikTok putting everything back in the bag and I will see you guys when I get back home. I know. <laughs> I remember eating outside at this McDonald's. Yeah.